Europe's top nuclear mines are turning to China, and the shift is shaking up the global race to recreate the power of the stars on Earth. Frustrated by years of delays in Western fusion projects, leading scientists from France, Germany, the UK, and several EU nations are now betting on Beijing's breakneck momentum. The trigger came this week in the Chinese city of Hefei, where foreign researchers signed the Hefei Fusion Declaration, formally joining China's Burning Plasma Program. It marks a rare moment. Europe's top physicists aligning not with Washington or Brussels, but with Beijing. The reason is speed, which Chinese officials proudly call China Speed. While Europe's massive ITER project in France won't fire meaningful fusion reactions until 2039, China's best tokamak is racing for completion by 2027. If successful, it could become the first reactor in history to achieve net energy fusion, producing more power than it consumes. Beijing sees this as a strategic even geopolitical breakthrough. Fusion isn't just clean energy. It is future power, national power, and scientific prestige rolled into one. And China is moving fast to seize that advantage. We are on the verge of entering a new phase of burning plasma, a pivotal moment where fusion can sustain itself through its own heat. But this is still uncharted territory with major engineering and physics challenges ahead. For many European researchers, that uncharted territory is exactly the attraction. They argue that Western fusion ambitions, once seen as the world's best bet, are now shackled by bureaucracy, political hesitation, and slipping timelines. In less than two years, we completed civil construction and brought major systems close to readiness. This is what we call China speed. With European expertise now flowing into China, the global fusion race has taken a political turn. And if China's best reactor delivers first light in 2027, Beijing may not just catch up, it may leap ahead, reshaping the balance of scientific power for the next century.